the Albert Bartlett Novices Hurdle is next. This is the Three Mile Novice Hurdle. And slightly smaller field for this one than we had for the previous race. Definitely a lack of novices this season, as most of the novice races have been slightly smaller fields. And at the top of this one, then we've got Bucephalus Idea for David Robertson. I love my brick, Kevin Meenan, Mangum Doodle for Craig Allen, Sonning Eye, Darren Thompson, Atonement, Joshua Sutherland, Discoed Fields for Craig Allen, Fire, Joshua Sutherland, Hidden Persuader, Leon Van Rensburg, Pretty Ears, Craig Beckwith, and Princess for Alex Cherry. So two of the stranger named horses in the league in this one pretty ears and i love my brick and oh there they go <laughs> let's see what happens in this one then the albert bartlett or the spa hurdle depending on what version of the game you're playing i suppose if they get over flight number one then it's pretty ears who's gone off into the lead with princess in second and then Mangum Doodle, Hidden Persuader and Discoed Fields are next. But the field are pretty tightly grouped, although Pretty Ears is two lengths clear. And skipping over the second. Let's over that one nicely. The grey rider right on the far side is Darren Thompson's sodding eye. The back marker early on is I Love My Brick. So it's Pretty Ears in the lead and I Love My Brick at the back as they get over number three. And pretty Ears it is that leads by a good two lengths or so. Hidden Persuader is moved up with a second on the outside then Princess, Bucephalus idea and then Atonement. Disco Fields is next. Get back to Sonning Eye Fire and I Love My Brick is the back marker. So the pace is pretty standard and pretty as is clear in the lead. By about three. Hidden Persuader wide on the track. Well, Leon will be hoping that one cooked in at some point, giving away a little bit of ground running that wide on the track, but not all that much as the turns are not that sharp here. Now Pretty Ears is in the lead from Hidden Persuader second, Disco Fields is third, Princess Alex Cherry is fourth, then Atonement on the inside of Mangum Doodle with Bucephalus idea after that one, and then Fire, and the only grey in the field, Sonning Eye, and the back marker is I Love My Brick. Now they're quite well strung out to say they've only been going for about a mile as they get over the fifth they've got two more miles to race and pretty is he's in the lead and leading by four or five to disco fields who's traveling nicely in second hidden persuader is third and then atonement princess is after that one and then mangum doodle with fire next and then bucephalus idea sonning eye and finally i love my brick at the backs out of the order it's pretty Static as they race up past the stand with the gold cup looming ever closer and the crowd anticipating a wide open gold cup this year and Pretty Ears is in the lead by five lengths or so who hidden persuade up as they get over the six that'll be the last on the next circuit and Pretty Ears leads by about four lengths to hidden persuade a second atonement in the black and red is moving into third on the inside of that one. Disco Fields, Princess on the outside is fifth. Then comes Fire, the second of the Joshua Sutherland horses. Then Bucephalus Idea, the grey sonning eyes move to the inside. Widest on the track now is Mangum Doodle, and the back marker is still Kevin Meenahan's I Love My Brick. But it's Pretty Ears who's in the lead by about three lengths. As they race away from the stand and skip over flight number seven which they all got over nicely these novice hurdlers so all jump in well and pretty ears is in the lead as it has been since the outset making sure everybody else in the field has got a sight of its pretty ears as it skips over number eight with disco field second and then bucephalus idea on the outside of atonement with hidden persuader and then fire sonning eye and princess the orders Pretty much as you were in the back two, Mangum Doodle and I Love My Brick as they take number nine and they're racing down towards the final three flights now. And pre Pretty Ears takes them into the final mile with a lead but down to just two now. With Bucephalus Idea going nicely around the outside, 
Discard Fields on the inside, Hidden Persuader and Atonement between them. Fire switches to the outside, Sonny Eye is going to look for a split up the inside. And Princess is going to try and come widest of all as they take the third last. And back to I Love My Brick and Mango Doodle. And no more than ten lengths off the lead and are not out of it. They've still got six, seven furlongs to race and they've got two more flights to take. And Pretty Ears is in the lead by a length and three quarters to Discard Fields. Blue Seven as I dare. Hidden Persuader in the blue. Princess trying to come round the outside of Fire Atonement behind that one. Sonny Eye looking for room, then trying to get closer, Mangum Doodle, I love my brick still sitting at the back. That pretty ears, leads by only a length now, it's Blue Cephalus idea, comes through to try and challenge, with fire going with that one, on the inside of it, Disco Fields, and Hidden Persuader, Princess on the outside, wide open still this Sonning Eyes now, switching to the outside, the grain is starting to eat up the ground as they race down towards the second last, and over the second last they go, Pretty Ears is only in the heat lead by head now, here comes Sonning Eye up the centre of the track, and Sonning Eye hits the front, Sonning Eye the grey takes it up, racing towards the final three and a half furlongs, they'll swing towards home in a minute, it's Sonning Eye in the lead from Mangum Doodle, who's come right through from the back, then Fire is also getting back into it again now, Disco Fields is still there, one or two of those early leaders have dropped away, but it's Sonning Eye who's in the lead Sonning Eye by about three lengths to fire in second Mangum Doodle Disco Fields Hidden Persuader now gets going they race down towards the final flight and it's Sonning Eye who's two and a half lengths clear but they're queuing up behind to take it on Sonning Eye's in the lead being chased by Disco Fields Hidden Persuader fire and Mangum Doodle they get over the final flight Sonning Eye's still in the lead but he's beginning to tire Sonning Eye a furlong to go he's being swallowed up by the field now and Fire who takes it up Fire's gone off into the lead from Disco Fields and Hidden Persuader it's fire just in front. Hidden Persuaders fighting back. On the inside is Disco Fields, and on the outside is Atonement. It's going to be almost forward line. Disco Fields and Atonement. Disco Fields and Atonement. Flash past the post together. And it's hard to split those two. And the angle is very deceptive as well. I would think it favours the far side. And it looks like it's going to be Disco Fields by a good hit. In the end, Josh Sutherland will be second and third. Those front five have finished well clear. Disco Field stakes it for Craig Allen. Atonement second for Joshua Sutherland, who was also third with fire. Hidden Persuader, Leon Van Rensburg fourth. And Sonny Eye for Darren Thompson was fifth.